December 10th, that is today, is the International Human Rights Day. International days are celebrated to bring awareness in the public, to mobilize political will and resources, and to discuss and debate on the issue and the current topics. Human Rights Day is very very important as it is directly related to human beings and their dignity. December 10th every year will have a theme. This year the theme is recover better, stand up for human rights. The 2020 human rights day theme is recover better, stand up for human rights. Actually, UNO, United Nations Organization, on December 10th, 1948, adopted a resolution, UDHR, Universal Declaration of Human Rights. The UDHR is a milestone document that proclaims the basic human rights which every human being is entitled regardless of their race, caste, color, religion, region, language, political or other opinions. And 10th December that is today is an opportunity to reaffirm the importance of human rights in building the world we want. And after that we have so many human rights conventions like CEDA, C -E -D -A -W, Convention on Elimination of All Forms of Discrimination Against Women, 1979. We have Covenant on Civil and Political Rights, Covenant on Socio-Economic Rights. We also have Convention with Respect to Protection of Disabled Rights, UN Convention on Child Rights, UN Convention on Refugees, UN Convention on Status of Married Women, UN Convention on Statelessness, so many conventions to protect human rights. In India, we have Human Rights Act through which National Human Rights Commission and State Human Rights Commissions are constituted. Internationally and nationally, human rights violations and human rights abuses are flaring up. Internationally, if you see Rohingya refugees, Uyghur Muslims, Balochistan issue, Syrian issue, in most of the African countries, there are various occasions internationally where in the last few years, we have seen human rights abuse. Even today, in Hong Kong, people are saying their human rights are being affected. In China, Uyghur Muslims are saying that their human rights are being affected. The mankind have a very long history of human rights. Parallelly, very long history of human rights abuses and violence and violation of human rights, violence against human beings. The simple example, our neighboring country Sri Lanka, the state itself perpetrated human rights violence against innocent victims while fighting against Elam war. So we have plethora of examples how Hitler persecuted Jews and followed anti-Semitism. That was worst form of human rights abuse and the history never forget and forgive this. And coming to modern day in the 21st century, we all should raise our voice and give a clarion call for human rights protection as human life is unique, ephemeral and every human being irrespective of his place of birth, irrespective of his color, caste, sex, everyone should enjoy his human life with basic human dignity. That is the purpose of today and let us all fight for that.